Next up, at UFC Vegas 99, we have the first of three lady fights. We got Alice Ardeline taking on short notice, Melissa Martinez. Alice Ardeline, nine and six in her career. Four and one in her last five. She's coming off that split decision loss in a short notice UFC debut. Taking on seven and one, Melissa Martinez. She's four and one in her last five, coming back after a two-year layoff. And Jacob and I are going to disagree here. It's going to be a controversy. We got Alice Ardeline. Alice Ardeline, very internet famous. Millions of followers across multiple platforms. And she got a lot of criticism when the UFC signed her because they're like, she's not good. She has five losses. They only signed her for her followers. But the losses are good. She had quality losses to UFC opponents. And they were early in her career. She put it together. She got through Wei Li, Tiana Belbia. Worked on her skills. Put together some wins and was signed by the UFC. Style-wise, she's a dog. She's going to move forward. She'll be a busy striker. She'll mix up some techniques. She can be sloppy, but she's going to move forward, try to get you to the ground, work you against the cage, and just grind. She's taking on Melissa Martinez. Melissa Martinez is a powerful striker. She can knock you out. She can knock maybe anybody out at this weight class. She's an active striker, good footwork. Takedown defense is pretty good, good enough to keep it on the feet. Her grappling, it's not just takedown defense. If she is taken down, she's got some decent jujitsu, solid submission defense. Coming back after two years away because of a knee injury. <coughs> Excuse me. I picked Alice to win her last fight. I think she did win her last fight. I thought she won that fight. I thought she moved forward. The striking was about even. She had some cage control. She had two takedowns. I thought she won that fight. Constant forward pressure, absolute dog. I think the layoff on the Melissa side is going to work for Alice. So I'm picking Alice again. I think Alice can win this fight. I think she can close the distance. I think she can make it ugly, make it dirty, and squeak out a win. I was going to place a plus three and a half, but it's minus 270. But Alice is the pick. What do you think, Jakey? Uh, yeah, I mean, Alice did, did not win that fight. She clearly lost the third round. The, the first round, the striking was pretty even. She was defending an arm bar basically for the last two and a half, three minutes, and that does not win you round. I mean, the whole last three minutes, she was just sitting on top of the fucking Shauna just defending arm bars. So that didn't win you round. She clearly lost the third round, got outstruck almost two to one, so she did not win that fight. Um, also, Alice Arlene at nine and six, just want to bring off a few points. Her last... Four wins. Remember, she's nine and six. Her last four wins before she lost to Shauna Bannon, who it's not very good, right? I mean, she's just not a very good fighter. And, uh, you know, Shauna clearly won that round. Her last win, let me just kind of focus this here. It's going to be a, a, an 0-5 fighter. Great okay. camera work. Nice one here. It's an 0-5 fighter. Uh, the one before that was a 2-1 and fighter with a doctor stoppage. The girl before that was 0-4. And the girl before that is uh, is three and five. So level of competition, I understand regionals and stuff like that, but those are like entry level fighters that she's fighting to get these wins before her UFC debut, where she kind of got smoked and looked clueless on the ground. She's definitely a tough girl, right? I will give her the toughness. She probably is going to march forward a little bit. Melissa Martinez has been away for a couple of years, but when I watch, watch Melissa Martinez, and I alluded to it the last fight when I'm on the Instagram what is she doing the last two years it looked like she has really really buckled down the strength the conditioning all the striking I see her really grinding in the wrestling grappling room and I think that's where she's gonna have the advantage I think she's gonna be faster on the feet but if she wants to take this fight to the ground I think Alice showed so many holes um in, in kind of the defense and the sweeps that gets a girl like Shauna who couldn't really capitalize but I think Melissa might be able to capitalize in some of these positions uh, if she gets a fight to the ground. And honestly, in the striking, remember when uh, uh, Natalia Silva had her debut and everyone's like, we don't know how she's going to look because she we, she hasn't fought in a long time. And I was like, I watched her Instagram and I know she's going to look fucking fast as shit. I think the same thing could happen here. I think Melissa Mar Martinez could come in and look really, really fast, mix in a takedown or two and really kind of dominate this fight. I just think our, our, our Alice Arlene is just tough and not a very skilled fighter. There's a lot of these comments. Alice does have an OnlyFans. She, it's, there's no nudity or anything. Her whole thing is like, I just tease. How it's do fun. you? Uh, how do you know that? She talks about it on Instagram. Like it's, it says it right there. I get a cough. I'm back. Um, 
So yeah, that's just wrong. Anyway, you have sent me all those Melissa Martinez working out videos. It is uh, concerning. Because I'm I on mean, the outside I mean, and she looks good. She's, she's going up the two different ropes like this. I'd love to see Alice throw that dump truck in the air with a fucking pull up or two. And this <laughs> girl's fucking just da, da, da. footwork looks good. I think she's really buckled down. And I think you're going to physically, I bet she doesn't look like that picture when she shows up uh, Friday. Yeah, I mean, anything's possible. You did, uh, you did start to make me a little nervous sending me those Instagram clips. <laughs> I just read that right <laughs> when you fucking hit it. Right, <laughs> literally, I read it and then it went boop, boop, message deleted. Oh my god, <laughs> that was so funny. That's a great comment too. Nice well, job, Louis Bond. It's gone. Next time he's gone. That plus three and a half, I do wish that was more affordable. I would have absolutely slammed that, but minus 230 or 270, whatever it was, People just isn't catch worth on. it. If you put one and one, if you, you put two and two together here with the back of his throat hurting and then <laughs> me hanging out with him this weekend for the first time in a while, I think you can put two and two together and realize we got a girthy situation going on. I bet. Yeah. I bet. Big boy Jacob. That's where all that energy comes from. Either way, we are split right down the middle here. $7,800 in DraftKings Fantasy. Probably not because Alice is going to need to get the takedowns and grind and really make something happen. I don't know if she's going to be able. To, I think she wins the fight, but I don't know if she's going to be able to grind out all of those takedowns. And I think so she's going to look better than... Um than the Shauna fight because that was short notice and stuff and she did kind of fade in that third round physically she looks good and uh, what we, I learned this week too is she's been working out with uh, Charles Johnson's camp and uh, wherever he's been so he Orlando. let me, yeah, he let me uh, know that as well so and he I know he fucking works hard so I'm sure she'll be in shape yeah there you go we want picks.com click S- become a sounds member sounds like you've been blowing balloons all day it's tough guys I'm here though would you rather no show at all or this. Have you tried like honey and tea and stuff like that? I've been drinking throat coat for two days. What about just like a warm, I bet if you just hit it with some, some warm water, honestly. Gar- Do you ever gargle? I was gargling salt water before. The problem is I don't warm. have a... No. Wait, say the... what you're about to say. What was I going to say? Were well, you gonna say the problem is I don't have a gag reflex, so it's hard for me to gargle? No. No, I'm pretty sure that? that's what you're about to say. I was gonna I say said, I don't, I don't have a sore throat. throat. Oh yeah, I, well, all right. My voice is gone, but my throat is fine. Yeah, Let's but see. still, if there's something going on, like a infection, this all it's not an infection. <laughs> yeah, I bet the fuck it's not. Holy <laughs> shit! You hear that thing? It's not an infection. It's just fucking what, <laughs> Angelo? Just taking a nap or something? Screaming. I scream a lot. I talk you very do, loud. You don't. I promise you guys, there was no screaming Saturday. <laughs> so. Become a premium member. I'll use the money to get this investigated. 